Uh, hello, I hope you are doing well. So in this video, I will go through the uh, methods that we can uh, simulate uh, the cooking of rice in a pot, considering mass transfer and heat transfer that they are cooked. So in this regard, I would consider to the axisymmetric geometry to start the, the model. So the thing is that uh, we are going to consider the heat transfer, uh, mass transfer inside the rice. So I this module. The second module would be the heat transfer in solid and fluid or heat transfer in solid. We can add this one. Uh, in the study part, I would select uh, time dependent. We're drawing the geometry, the first uh, step is that uh, I just select the length unit and I select a rectangle. The width of the rectangle would be 31 millimeter and the height of that would be 5 millimeter. Uh, it's uh, the dummy that uh, we are going to to use as a rice that we are going to cook. So the first step perform it's drawing the drawing the geometry secondly i just defined a new material i call it like rice i have a thermal conductivity here heat cap density and heat capacity uh, for these properties i go to parameters i define the R H O rice. It's one thousand one hundred kilogram per cubic meter. And for the For the other parameters, uh, so I, I, I just copy paste this one here as a density. But thermal conductivity and uh, heat capacity of the system is changing with the concentration of the moisture, and we need to define variables in this regard. So I defined the variables here. The first variable is like uh, thermal conductivity, I call it like kt and its value would be 0 0.14 plus 0 0.435 multiplied with c multiplied with molecular weight of h2o divided by RHO rice. So we define the molecular weight of water here. It's eighteen gram per mole. So the next step is the density is our capital. And the unit is what metro. <coughs> Sorry. Kill. It's the thermal conductivity. For the case of heat capacity, I call it CP here. So it would be 70.2 plus 2.05 multiplied with the E T to power 2. Uh, 
plus 0 0.002 multiplied with 3 t power 3. So the dt definition is t minus 0 degree c. And the unit uh, would be 1 per column. So, and the heat capacity unit would be <clears throat> Joule kilogram Kelvin. So it's uh, the variables that we are in our system. So we put these variables in materials properties part. So it Okay, C underline T and uh, K underline T. I can define them like R. The C P underline R or case of rice. So, and I can modify these names here. By R and C P. Underline R. So materials are defined here. Uh, the next step is to, is going to define the mass transfer properties. So I would uh, say how to just do that in uh, in coming video. <laughs>